how to install windows backup feature on domain controller if you want to take a system state backup or bare metal backup we need to install windows backup feature first windows server backup feature okay click on tools go to the windows server backup feature and once you are able to see here it is showing that backup your important files applications and entire server to a locally attached device or network share using windows visa okay windows server backup is not installed on this computer so now i i need to install that backup feature so what i will do i will just click on add ports and features from the server manager portal console so you just need to click on next installation type next server selection this on this server i want to install so click on next server roles you are able to see some of the roles are available here but we want to install feature called windows server backup feature so you just need to click on next button and go to the features tab under features tab you will be able to see that windows server backup feature you just need to select that option windows server backup and then click on next click on install so it will install windows server backup feature so install installation has been started now on dc001 so you will be able to see the status of the installation of the windows server backup feature once the installation uh, windows server backup installation installed so you, you will be able to see that installation succeeded on this server click on close button and after that once you go to the tool windows server backup and now you will be able to see that these options so now that message is not there that it was earlier showing that windows backup feature is not installed right so you can configure backup now okay so now how to configure that system set backup so when you click on the local backup so you will be able to see at the right side pane backup schedule and backup once i want to backup once or i want to backup schedule we can schedule from here okay so we will see that how to schedule a backup or backup once in next video thank you for watching